I'm starting not to hate it. Needs more towers. Yeah. More towers. Hey guys, my name is Fuzzy Cub and welcome back to Vault Hunters, episode 17. Now, I'd like to start off today by going through a little bit of a fan art that I have received. It is from a user called Ren Riley. Cowardly Corner Crew Unite. A cautious bear is a living bear. And the second piece I, 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 I love. It's actually from a real life friend of mine. So if you're watching Will, thank you so much. This is such a cool little thing. I'm going to put it up in a picture frame because, you know, it's, it, it's in real life. So I just have to take a picture of it. <laughs> so why don't we take down this picture and a picture frame and we will put the pictures up in our new mega base. Which is looking a little bit bare at the moment. So I think I want to have this area be where my fan art goes. So let's put up the one that we had from a few episodes ago. And here we go. Well, that's the first one. Then the second one. And this is... Uh, so true. So, so true. And then the next one, yay size, I think. And this one is from my friend Will. Look at that. He made a little Lego thing of me with a little controller and my name. That is so epic. So thank you very much, Will. Thank you very much. So, if any of you guys have any fan art or just want to send me anything, why don't you join the Olympuscraft Discord? The link should be in my video description, but if it's not, just like scream at me in the comments. We would love to have you guys on board. And, you know, season three of Olympuscraft should be starting in a few months. So, you know, get in there early. Now today, I kind of want to do something that everybody else on the server has been doing already. I want to go to some strongholds and I want to find some of those rare tomes because I'm sick of having to get CWG to fortune my ores. I want to have fortune 8 myself. So I think I'm going to just show you the highlights of the excursion that I've gone on. And I'm hoping I don't have to go too far because with five other people on the server all looking for the books, I'm going to have to go quite far out just to find the uh, strongholds that haven't been looted. Right, so my tactic at the moment is I am going to build a nether portal here. And hopefully that means that I will be in the third ring, but on the complete other side. Hopefully. Here we go. And we should be at about 18,000 blocks out. Okay. Let's put a temporary waypoint here. Hey, this is the library. Please be something good. Ah. I think this has been raided. Yep. Okay, let's try it this way. I know for a fact that these are unloaded chunks because I just saw lava and water streams forming. So the next piece of land I find, I'm going to land and throw a pearl. And hopefully these are not raided. Okay, that changed direction. And I dig straight into the library. And there's the first chest. And it's not looted. Yay. Loyalty. Eh. And smite. Meh. And you. Ooh. Unbreaking, yes. Thorns and efficiency. Hmm. 
Please read some good books. And it is... Fortune! Yes, I got one of them. I just need one more. Oh, another four. Looting, yes. Looting, yes. Look at the seat. Me. And power. Yeah, I can suppose I can put power on my bow. Okay, what are you? Feather falling. Me. Oh, we're going back. Okay, there's two. Efficiency. Fortune. Yes, 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 yes. I can go home. Nope, the easiest way to get home is probably just to go to the end and go home. So, yep. Not even gonna ask. So, we finally have our fortune box. Now, all we need to do is get up to, I believe, two more levels in Vein Miner to get up to five. So, our fortune goes to fortune two. Then, we need to get a Paxel with fortune if we want to get fortune eight. Or we could just be lazy and go for fortune seven on a pickaxe. But, uh,. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Should I go for Fortune 8 or should I stick with Fortune 7? So, oh, two days have passed in actual real life and I just finished two vaults. One of them was a locked vault with the robot boss, which was tough. He killed my health totem. How dare he? And the second one I bailed out of because yeah, I wasn't really feeling that vault. But I am now 100% completely out of crystals. So, uh, we, we need to do some vaultering. So here's just a few clips of the torture of vaultering, because if I have to do it, you have to suffer through it too. Ah, we do not have blaze rods. I suppose we're going hunting. Um, so, yeah, I don't want to talk about it. So, we have run into an issue. I do not have a heart of diamond, and to make one, I just, I, yeah, I, I'm, I'm not making that. Maybe one of the other guys will have one to trade. Otherwise, I'm going to have to go stoneling hunting. Yay. Anyway, back to the reason why we are making all of these lovely crystals, which I think I have. How many is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. I have 12 of them. In this chest, I have the makings of three knowledge stars. And the only thing I'm missing is star shards, well, star essence. So I need to run a lot of vaults to get enough star essence to make my three knowledge stars. Because in today's episode, I would like to get Chef and fairy lights unlocked, and then I want to unlock drawers. I think drawers is probably a good idea to start because I think I'm going to go with applied energistics afterwards, and it it's like yeah, it, it's just a really good system for integrating drawers into. So yeah, looks like we're gonna have to run a few vaults. But uh, why don't we check our catalysts actually? See if any of these have any nice modifiers on them. Let's see, this one gives a positive and fast, and this one gives a positive and negative. So, mega strong, yeah, it's good. The mega strong, ooh, super healing, and fragile. I think fragile is your armor takes a beating. The super healing, yeah, that's really good, and fast. Oh god, that's actually quite a good fault. Let's put you over here. Personal space, also a good bolt. Hmm. Extended and fast, speedy, crowded. No, 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 no. Save someone fast. Eh. Exploration, standard. 
Personal space fast again. Healing and poisonous. Hmm. Personal space again. Resilient. Easy fast, easy to fatiguing. Super healing again. Mega strong would be good. And personal space. None of them are very good. So, um, vault ready. Got all my stuff done. All my checks done. And I'm gonna run a few vaults. And if anything interesting happens, I will show you some recordings of it. Otherwise, you won't see anything. Huh. Right, so I just did a vault and I was putting all my stuff away. And I just realized, before you guys start screaming at me in the comments, I can already make three knowledge stars. I always forget that it's eight, eight star shards around the core, not nine. So, uh, yeah, let's, let's make some knowledge stars. Hey, I remembered it. And that, and then this, and then these around it. Yeah, we can do three knowledge stars. So, yeah. Fuzzy can't count. Again. So, you know the drill. Let us consume. One, two, three. Aw, I had the sounds turned off. Anywho, let us do what we said we were going to do. Of course, first thing, fairy lights unlock. Chef, unlock. And if any of you guys are wondering, I used to be a chef for like 20 years, so that's a, that's a nice mod for me. And last, but very much not least, Oh, this is a difficult one. Drawers or applied energistics. You know what? I'm going to contradict myself and I'm going to unlock applied energistics. Because I really, really, really want to start getting my storage system done because the chest monster is coming. Hmm. So now comes the harder part. You talk getting all the knowledge stars was the hard part. If you take a look at these... Just these two things that I need to make. I need a pog, which I don't even have yet. And I need an echo pog, which is just... <sighs> now we are very, very close to a pog. Where are we? This one. We have eight of the nine pog gems and we can fortune the stuff in there. And I do have one Puffium in my ores tank. But what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to ask some of the other guys in the server if they want to maybe trade some Puffium ore for something. And then we're going to be echo hunting. So, unfortunately, guys, that is all the time I have for today. If you liked the video, please like, subscribe, comment, and I'll see you all next week. Bye bye.